Happy summer. And welcome to Realtors Corner. I'm Nick Bajellis. And I'm Joanna Rao. We are here to help you soak in the Realtors education race. So to start off, let's talk about everyone's favorite summer getaway, condos. Tracy Van Lanschute helps out with some tips on this hot, hot commodity. For many home shoppers, purchasing a condo makes more sense for them than buying a house. Whether you have the buyer or the seller, you should check to see if the condo qualifies for financing. First, look up the condo to see if it's either Fannie Mae, FHA, or VA approved. If your condo is on one of these lists, your financing should be good to go. If your buyer's loan amount exceeds the Fannie Mae loan limit, your mortgage will fall into a jumbo category, and there may be some other specific guidelines that have to be met. Always get a copy of the budget. Check to see if there are or are not 10% in reserves because this would dictate the type of financing the condo might qualify for them right from the start. Have a condo questionnaire filled out. Your lender can provide you with one and review it up front so that you know if the condo qualifies for financing. For more information on how to learn about condo financing, you can reach me, Tracy Van Lanshoot, at 239-471-3696. Thanks, Tracy. If you don't take her advice, you might as well build a sandcastle and call it a day. Yeah. Did you know that the hottest temperature ever was 134 degrees in California? Joanna, we're here for market stats, not some random world stats. I beg to differ. Susan, help us out with what are this summer stats. Hi, it's Susan Milner with Florida Future Realty, bringing you May 2019's Lee County Market Snapshot. For the month of May 2019, we saw an overall increase again from our April 2019 sales in single-family homes, up 8.1% year over year. We saw a very slight decrease in townhomes and condo sales month over month. The condo and townhouse market showed sales were up 8.7% year over year though. Broken down by cities, almost every city in Lee County showed a volume and median price increase. Are we currently in a buyer's or a seller's market? We have a 5.7 month supply of inventory of single family homes, keeping us in what most would consider a balanced or stable market. The amount of active single family home listings continue to increase year over year. However, we have been building more homes and have experienced population growth. Also to note, our distressed market is virtually non-existent with only 25 foreclosure sales and no short sale closings noted in Lee County in May 2019, compared to a tad more in May of 2018. I hope you learned something from today's market snapshot. Be sure to check out all the details in written and chart form by logging into your MLS dashboard. Tune in next month for your monthly market snapshot from the Royal Palm Coast Realtor Association. Now back to our anchors, Nick and Joanna. Much better. Thanks, Susan. Nick, do you know why I get excited for summer? Why is that? Well, it means Florida Realtor Convention is just around the corner. What do they even have there? Well, it's the best Florida Realtor trade show, and they have hundreds of vendors, education, and some of the best connections that you could make there. A lot of bests. Well, I'm definitely going. Are you? Yes, sir. And you can all go too, August 21st to 22nd in Orlando. Just sign up at conventions.floridarealtors.org. Should we set up a meet and greet for our fans? Well, I mean, we'll see what we can do with them. But until then, keep tuning in to your favorite show, Realtors, Realtors Corner. Corner. Stay classy.